everybody, it's Sharon. Today's lesson is San Francisco City Hall. City Hall is where the government takes place. And here we have a mayor and 11 city supervisors who represent different neighborhoods in the city. But more than that, business also happens here. Taxes are paid, permits are issued, ideas are fleshed out, events happen. Of course, many, many weddings happen. So let's have a closer look at this building. San Francisco City Hall of 1906 took 20 years to build, but only a few minutes to be demolished in the earthquake and fire of 1906. Local architect Arthur Brown, influenced by the École de Beaux-Arts in Paris, drew up new plans for a city hall. Four stories tall and dominated by a dome that's 307 and a half feet, about 20 feet taller than the dome of the U.S. Capitol in Washington, D.C. Work began in 1913 and was finished by 1916. As you approach the building from the main Civic Center Plaza, you'll notice a pediment featuring maritime and agricultural imagery. Entering the building, you reach the main rotunda with its grand staircase. The story and the values of San Francisco are told in its symbols. As you look up to the dome, notice the four medallions at each corner. First, equality, a woman holding a triangle. Next, liberty, a woman holding an olive branch. Then, strength, a man holding a sword. And finally, learning, a young boy holding an open book. Nearby, a window featuring the ship San Carlos, the first Spanish ship to sail into the bay in 1769. On either side of the clock, the Phoenix, and above the clock, Father Time. San Francisco has witnessed many events in this building, including the wedding of Marilyn Monroe and Joe DiMaggio, and the assassination of Harvey Milk and Mayor Moscone in 1978. Cannot forget the earthquake of 1989. During that earthquake, the dome of City Hall moved about four inches off its base, and the whole City Hall was closed for almost 10 years. Retrofit included creating a moat around the building and putting the building on base isolators, which would cushion it in the event of another earthquake. Following the retrofit, City Hall's dome got a new coating of 23 karat gold leaf. If you go to the mayor's office on the second floor and look out the main window, you'll be looking at the United Nations Plaza and a special sign painted for City Hall. An art piece painted by Rigo 23 in 2003, and it's called Truth. If you imagine he's speaking truth to power, you wouldn't be very far off. Catch you later.